Insert image e in Microsoft Word. This video is divided into three parts, including inserting images in Word on Windows and on the web, and how to save frequently used images for future use. Let's start with the first part, insert images in Word on Windows. Depending on your version of Windows and Word, you can choose from the following methods to add that perfect expressive touch to your text. Using the Imagey pane in Windows 10 or 11. The Imagey pane offers a user-friendly interface for selecting and inserting emojis directly into your document. Click on where you want the Imagey to appear. If you are using Windows 10 or 11, hold on the Windows key and press a semicolon or a period. For Mac system, press Control, Command and Space keys together. In the Imagey pane, there are different Imagey categories. Clicking on any image will insert it into the document where the cursor is located. When the image pane is being enabled, you can directly search for the image you need. For example, typing party will show various images related to parties. Then click it to insert it into the document. To adjust the size of images, just select the images you have inserted into your document. Under the Home tab, choose a preset size from the font size drop down list. Using the Imagey keyboard add-in to insert emojis. For users with Word 2013 Service Pack 1 or later, the Imagey keyboard add-in provides an extensive collection of emojis. To use this add-in, you need to install it on your Word firstly. Go to the Insert tab, select Get Add-ins. If you don't see the Get Add-ins command, under the Insert tab in the ribbon, you will need to add it manually. Click the Customize Quick Access Toolbar drop-down arrow and select More Commands from the menu. In the Word Options dialog box, select Commands not in the ribbon from the Choose Command from drop-down list. Find and select Get Add Ins in the left Commands list. Click the Add button to add the Get Add Ins command to the right pane. Click OK to save the changes. The Get Add Ins command is now added to the Quick Access Toolbar. You can click on it to open the Office Add Ins Store. In the Office Add in Store, type Imagey in the search box and press Enter. Once the Imagey keyboard Add in appears, click the Add button. In the next prompt box, click Continue. Now, you need to wait for the Imagey keyboard Add in to finish installing. Once installed, the Imagey keyboard Add in will be added under the Insert tab. And the Imagey keyboard pane will automatically open on the right side of your document. Now you can use the emojis on the pane. Click on where you want the image to appear. Then select an image under a category you need to insert it into your document. You can search for the image you need by typing words in the search box. For example, typing sad will show various images related to sad face. Then click on an image you need to insert it into the document. The skin tone option at the bottom of the pane allows you to adjust the skin tone of images that support different skin colors. If clicking on the skin tone options does not have any effect, it could be due to these reasons. At the bottom of the pane, there are text and different sizes options, each serving different purposes. Choose the text option, the image will be inserted as a plain text character. This is useful when you want the image to align with the rest of your text formatting. And behave like any textual character, including adapting to text color and size changes. If you specify a size and click an image, the image will be inserted as an image, using the built-in icons to insert vector emojis. Microsoft 365 subscribers can also use built-in icons as emojis in their documents. To use the built-in icons, click on where you want the image to appear. Go to the Insert tab and select Icons in the Illustrations group. Wait for a few seconds while the icon loads, and then a stock images window will pop up. In the icons menu, click on the right arrows to navigate through the different icon categories. Select an icon category. Here I select faces. Select one or more face icons as you need. And then click the insert button to add the selected faces to the document. Using the icons feature in Microsoft 365 to insert emojis offers several advantages. Higher quality and scalability. 
Images inserted via the icons feature are vector graphics, which means they maintain high quality regardless of scaling. You can resize them without losing clarity, which is ideal for professional documents, where presentation quality is crucial. Greater customization. Icons can be formatted like any other graphic in Word. You can change their color, apply effects, and rotate them. Consistent style across devices. Since the emojis are inserted as graphics, they will look the same on any device or platform that the Word document is opened on, regardless of the device's image support. Insert emojis in Word on the web. Using Word on the web comes with its own set of image tools, accessible directly within your web browser. Once logged in your Microsoft account, navigate to the Word section and then open a document online. You can create a new blank document or open an existing one. In the document, click on where you want to place the image. Go to the Insert tab, click the image icon, and then choose the image to insert into your document. If you need more emojis, click on More Emojis in the drop-down menu to access a wider range of categories and emojis. Adjusting the size of emojis in Word on the web is like resizing any text character. Save emojis for future use. KuTools for Word offers a feature called Auto Text to help save frequently used emojis, making them quickly accessible for future use. Once you have KuTools for Word installed, go to the KuTools tab and select Auto Text. Select the emoji you want to save. Go to the Auto Text pane and click the new Auto Text button. It is optional to create a new category for it, or directly select an existing category. Name the selected image. Click the Add button. The selected image has now been added as an Auto Text entry. In the future, you can access and insert this image into your document from the Auto Text pane with one click only, wherever your cursor is located. This is the end of the video. Thanks for watching.